Hi, I'm Rob McClure, and I play Charlie Chaplin in Chaplin the Musical on Broadway. I think Chaplin is a complicated dude. Uh, he, he, he lived a complicated life. You know, we're talking about a man who came to America in 1913 with absolutely nothing alone, and within seven years was the most famous man in the world. He was also from a broken home. He had a, a mother who was locked in an asylum by the time he was nine, an alcoholic father. I mean, his life early on is almost Dickensian in its, in its uh, sort of poverty. I tried to create, you know, a, a space that felt a little bit like a dressing room and a little bit like a Chaplin museum, where I could sort of uh, come in and be as immersed in his uh, his world as possible. <laughs> I know that anyone buying a ticket to see this is looking for the hat, the cane, and the mustache. You know what I mean? That that's that's the Charlie Chaplin they know and they love. Um, so I definitely feel a responsibility to get that right. But then there's also the, the aspect of Chaplin as a man. Uh, not as the little tramp. And uh, that's where I think we have a lot of surprises in store for the audience. There are some Chaplin aficionados who know all about that, but many do not. They don't know much beyond the hat, the cane, and the mustache. So uh, it's an opportunity to, to educate. I think that the need to be funny was something that I think he felt throughout the course of his life. It was, uh, you know, he was a little guy, and I, I can relate to that. So I think he clung to that as well, that, that sense that he could make people laugh. Um, and then I think he discovered much more powerfully that he could make people cry. And he was able to provide a bit of a sucker punch in that way. It is a marathon. It's a marathon uh, every night. Uh, it, it, it required uh, a whole lot of training. I took tightrope lessons and violin lessons and roller skating lessons and voice lessons and uh, so it's de it's extremely demanding physically but I I'm doing a Broadway show about one of the most famous physical comedians of all time. That should be hard. If that's easy we're not doing it right. It's not impressive enough. I will never forget the first time I put the mustache on. I had the makeup, I had the eyebrows, I had the eyeliner, I messed up my hair uh, the bowler hat was on, and I leaned in the mirror, and I put the mustache on, and it was creepy. I was struck by the, the resemblance. You know, there's no greater reward than having someone at the stage door go, I've seen every Chaplin movie there is, and, and you got it. You got it. I mean, that's, there's nothing more rewarding, and I, I'm thrilled to come here every night.